Hey everybody, they really here. Thank you so much for joining me for another episode of Norn 9 Var Commons. In the last episode, we finished off the good ending for Koharu and Kakeru. So, now we're going to do the bad ending. So this is going to be a short video, um, as their short ending is not nearly as long as uh, Mikoto and Sakuya's bad ending was. I know this because I've already recorded it once, and I had screwed up the sound, so now I have to record it again. <laughs> and unfortunately, I had recorded several episodes before I realized that my mic had gotten messed up some mysteriously, somehow. I have no idea what happened. But enough of my uh, moping and complaining and misery. I'll go ahead and read this for you. It's going to be a short video. Um, so I'm going to be publishing two nor nine videos today because I don't want this to be the only thing published. So uh, just sit back, relax, and let me read you this little bit of a story before we start the next one. Alright, so all I do is smile brightly, and this will lead us to our uh, bad ending. Although, I have to make sure to stop it at the right point because since I've already done this once, it's not going to stop for me. Here's where we had the new stuff. Although, you know, these flashbacks are old, but... I don't know. I don't understand him. What he does sometimes makes no sense to me. It makes my chest hurt. It hurts, and it makes me really, really mad, too. But at the same time, I feel lonely. Nanami... Oi, Shiranoi. Run. Run. No, no, stop. You have to stop, please. You have to stop this. Dad, I bought you to her just like you asked. Good, huh? You look hurt. What happened? Did she burn you? Yeah, I'm going to get the burns looked at. Be more careful in the future. That body does not belong to you, you know. I understand. This body is an important vessel for your work, Dad. I'll take care of it. Yuiga, wait! Don't go! Please! Oh, come on. Don't cry. You make it sound like we won't ever see each other again. But Dad has stuff he wants to talk to you about, so I brought you to him. Listen to him, okay? Oh, by the way, I heard Dad was the one who gave you your name. I should have guessed. Dad has the best naming sense. It's a good one. Make sure not to forget this time, okay? Ask Dad nicely, and maybe he'll call you by it. But won't you call me by it, Yuiko? <laughs> Don't be silly, of course. I'll call you by your name if I need to. It's really awkward not to have a name to call somebody by. But... Although, now that I think about it, I doubt I'll have that much need anymore. Come, Koharu. No! Stop! Let me go! Huh. Have you any manners, my son? Quit your chattering and go to see to your duties. Oh, right. Sorry, Dad. This third wheel will scoot off now. Mika, no! Don't go! You have no idea how much I regretted letting you go all those years ago. But now that I have you, my dearest wish will come true. Everything I want will be mine. Come, let us talk. Tell me what happened to you while you were away. Tell me who you met and what you learned. Tell me everything. I want to know how much you have grown. No! Yuiko! And that is the bad ending, which is really, really short compared to, like I said, Mikoto and Sakuya's. Especially this being one of the, you know, main recommended romances that it seems. I'm really surprised they made it that short. Well, anyway, um, yeah, like I said, since this is a short video, I'll be uploading two videos today, which will be this one and the first video in 
Nanami and uh, Heishi's relationship. So stay tuned for that. It'll be up shortly. Thank you so much for joining me, and I hope to see you in some of my future videos. I'd be so grateful for any likes, comments, subscriptions, or shares with your friends to show some support. Uh, I wish you all health, happiness, and safety. They're really signing out. Bye-bye, everybody.